Hi everyone, welcome to another video of Show Me The Stuff Inside. Today we will see the Virgil One Full Scale Polystone Statue from Prime One Studio. Uh, you can see the box, it's huge. It was uh, very hard to get it to my place. But first I want to tell you, I bought this from a figure shop. It's the best uh, shop in Greece and it's like the... Uh, playground for any adults and everyone uh, collector that wants to buy ex expensive statues or any other figurines. So follow the description of the video and you will find the link uh, from the eShop and you won't regret it. So you can see that we have, uh, it's very big, I don't know how to turn it around, but we have the Virgil uh, in the front, it's from Devil May Cry 5 and the number we have is 277 out of 600 so we'll start try to unbox this big box and inside oh, we have some goodies so uh, here we have the uh, the series have four statues it's Virgil it's Dante, it's Nero, and one more is the V. Oh, we have a nice uh, how to connect all the parts. That's very good. Oh, we have a calendar uh, for 2021. Oh, but it's okay. And then we have like a magazine or a catalog with other statues. Oh, that looks so good. Oh my God, let's see how... This is so big. Let's see if I can remove it. We have the top and we have the logo of Prime One Studios. And let's see somehow how to open this. This is gonna be hard for sure. I hate so much this part. the nose and everything but uh, this is come on also it's my first and oh my god this is crazy uh yeah okay so we have the home it's too far. It's 
see that they protect it so, so very good. So uh, I was looking for the base, but it's on the bottom. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. So we have instructions so first we get the base this is crazy here also we have the 277 out of 600 oh my god I'm so excited this is my first prime one studio and Nope, this is not <laughs> the next one. But this is... Oh my god. Okay, next part we have his jacket. Oh shit, this is so good. His jacket. Next we have ah, the other part for the base. Let's go. Here, perfect. Then we have the head. He looks so badass. Trying to fit it right. But I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Okay. Then we have the face. And next we have the Ward. Wow. And we connect the parts. And it goes like this. So, oh my God, this is so, so good. It's about 77 centimeters, the height, and it's absolutely stunning. This is so good. I mean, it's polystone, it's prime one, and it's kind of expensive, but nowadays nothing 
uh, it's uh, impossible with payment plans. But now let's take a closer look. And now let's see some more closer look. So yeah, you can see that the body, everything, it's so very nice sculptured. We have the katana's word. We have nice face and the hair and the boots are it's incredible sculptured the details are amazing uh, even the leather uh, jacket back uh, there are some uh, damaged just wait somehow to turn it because it's very heavy you can see here it's damaged and we have nice colors and the two magnets that connect uh, the hands with this sword so keep it steady and the base it's wow prime one studios are the best it's one of the top uh, companies uh, creating uh, polystone statues and this is the most expensive and the biggest and the best quality uh, statue and collectible in entire my entire collection this is a masterpiece. I wanted to, to have one at least in my collection. And they say that if you buy one, then you're buying more. So I already pre-ordered the V, the human form of Virgil after he stabbed himself with the Yamato and separate the, the human part with the uh, devil part. But this is so good. Uh, if you like and you're a fan of, far, of Devil May Cry 5, uh, you can try and get one for yourself or one of the four statues uh, they are releasing. But this is a masterpiece. Uh, I, I'm not regretting every euro I paid for this. And thank God I love it to have it in my collection. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, comment and share. And see you next time.